What's up everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video I'm going to give you a quick overview tutorial of the Rocket Reach platform and its different benefits and features. Now Rocket Reach is a contact uh, service and email lookup platform or service that allows persons to contact experts in various industries. So to get to their websites, go here uh, to rocketreach.co and you'll land on their homepage right here. Uh, of course, you can learn more about their, pri their products, their solutions, their customers, their pricing. We'll look at their pricing in a second. Now, here they tell you that you can connect with precisions to various uh, professional individuals in many industries and fields. And here they are trusted by many of the big name industries. As you can see here, they offer you a powerful tool to find your ideal prospect, no matter what your business is, with ex exceptional data quality, automated prospect lists, intent, data and even AI powered recommendations to recommend people for you. Now they are compatible with many or they can integrate with many of the popular platforms in the business uh, field as well as here uh, they have over 700 million profiles, 60 million companies and over 180 searches annually. As well here as some testimonials, some reviews and more. Now let's take a look at their pricing pretty quickly. As you can see here, they have uh, three plans. The Essentials, which allow you to contact by email only. The Pro, which allow you to contact by email or phone. Or the Ultimate here for extra features. Now you can scroll down here to read more or learn more about each feature and compare the features of each plan right here. And if I click on Learn More, I can learn more or uh, view the frequently asked questions about the features right here. Now, uh, you can log in if you already have an account or sign up. So if I click on sign up here, I can sign up with my full name, business email and password, or I can sign up with Google, uh, Microsoft or Facebook. So I'm going to enter my name, business email and password pretty quickly and then continue to get access. Okay, now that I entered my full name, my business email and my password, I'm ready to click on instant access. Okay, and now I'm in. So make sure to use your real name, your uh, business email. And here I'm on uh, the offer me the uh, prices. This is for the individual plans and for the team plans, of course, the prices are a bit higher. Now let's go to individual plans once again and um, I'll select the, let's select the pro plan for this uh, video. Of course, these are the prices for uh, like uh, the uh, annual plans. Here I need to verify my email. Okay, and once I signed up with my information, I'm redirected to my main dashboard. Now here they gave me two sample contacts, Tim Cook, of course, the CEO of Apple. And uh, here I'm in the people. If I go to companies, I can see that I start, I can search, start searching here for a company name or domain. Let's search for Google, for example. Okay, hit enter. And now I can uh, view all the companies here that are related to Google. Um, let's choose Google Developers. It'll open up in a new tab. And here I have the top Google Developers employees. So I can here view uh, the list and choose the employee I want to contact. Okay, click here on view. And here I can view uh, this uh, contact information. So their location, their uh, project, they are project manager, so their post, their education, and uh, the information related to them. And I can click here to view their uh, email and phone. Of course, I just don't want to pronounce their uh, like name, like Ranjana Shah. Um, I hope I pronounced this name right. Now, if I click on view their profile here, Okay, looks like I'm on the free trial and I haven't verified my email yet, so I cannot access this page. However, this is the way to access it. Now, here I have the search. And as you can see, the search filter is still added. So Google, let's clear the filter. And let's go to people once again. And here I can in people search uh, by many criteria such as 
LinkedIn URL, job title, industry, revenue. So let's say education. Okay, hit search. Okay, so it uh, looks like I've hit the temporary limit on this section. No worries, I just showed you how it works. Uh, now I can view the, I can enter a name, I can enter a location. Here I can choose in the US, states, or even Africa, Asia, Europe, and any location. And I can manually edit the radius. Now I can choose here or filter by occupation, like role or uh, job title, department in the company, management level. So you have full control over the specific details of the person you want to contact, employee count, revenue. So as you can see here, I have uh, control over each detail. Now, uh, contact info, web address, and stuff like that. Now here in the my lists, I can view my own lists here. Okay, and of course this is empty because I haven't added anyone in my list. I can upload a CSV file to uh, like import my contacts here, and or I can create a new list of people or companies. So let's click on create new list. I can enter list name, let's name it test. Okay. And now the list is now created. However, it is still empty. And that's because I haven't added any contact yet. If I click here, the list is empty. I can download it or upload CSV file. Now, if I click here on upload lists, I'll be redirected to this page where I can upload a list of people or companies and then begin upload. And here I have a CSV file or I like to paste a list of LinkedIn URLs. So that's option uh, is up to you. Let's say I want to have a CSV file. I can here use the rocket reach CSV template. And I, I download it here as a Excel file to add all my uh, like uh, companies or people and then upload it right here. So if I click on next, I can upload. Of course, I need to upload the same file, the same template that I uh, like downloaded after I filled it with all my contact or people and company names. You cannot upload like a random CSV file that you created yourself. It has to be their template. Now here you can select the file after you've edited it and you can import your people or company. And here I have, I can browser uh, extensions. I can get the browser extension for uh, Chrome here. It detects that I'm using Chrome and it asks me to install the uh, Chrome extension and it even gives you the step here, an extension to have it uh, pop up whenever you want to install here. And here I have my integrations. I can integrate here with lots of popular services such as Salesforce, uh, Google, Zapier, and others. And here I can view here the integration and apps. I can use uh, view the usage and uh, billing uh, like information of my account, the team management, let's view team management. So here I can view the team plans as, you can, as I showed you before, they have prices for individuals and teams. I can view my profile information, I can edit it, I can change the password. The API usage and settings here. I can view my API key here, the total contacts that I have, the lookup remaining. I have three lookups remaining here in my trial. I can generate here a new API key. And here I can create a webhook URL and enable endpoints here in lookup profile, lookup profile and company, or bulk lookup. Here uh, we had the integration of the app and have other settings right here such as contact preferences right here, save email type, JD, GDPR, email preferences, and privacy. And here I have uh, the usage. I can view my usage here. Here I have three usages remaining, and I need to verify my email in order to receive my free credit, the rest of my free credits. Um, okay, so that was pretty much it. That's how you can use the Rocket Reach uh, platform in order to reach contacts.